Mulched Ethereal Blades and the Wandering Trainer 1, guys. As you can see, it's gonna be a weird freaking game, guys, okay? I'll show you why, but we need to make a really good choice here. We have a Ginsu's or an Archangel or a Static Shiv. Ethereal Blades. I mean, Ethereal Blades can't be bad, right? I think Ethereal Blades is pretty fine. It could also go Story Beaver. I think I'll take Ethereal Blades. Oh boy, that's a weird one, guys. <laughs> that's a weird freaking game. Okay, uh, we have no portal. Instead, the game started with an encounter. And that encounter says... You can always play, you can always field at least seven units. So it doesn't matter which level you are. You can always play at least seven champions. Which is very weird, isn't it? It's the first time I got this. Maybe I should have gone Dragon, uh, Story Beaver reroll. I'm really not sure, bro. This is a weird freaking portal. I'm definitely supposed to play a better team here. Definitely supposed to play a way better team. We are playing the carry augment for the dude. Uh, we can play bruiser. Okay, I mean this looks pretty okay. We play sniper. I know I'm playing three juicers, but that's fine. I think I think three behemoth. So we are playing the carry augment for Shen. I think the best way to play this uh, portal is to play a reroll comp. That is ideally a one cost reroll comp, but the two cost is also fine, I think. Because then at level 6, you're basically level 7, right? At level 5, you're basically level 7, right? And you can roll for Kogma. How am I losing so hard against this guy? Oh boy, it's, I'm not sure what to think about this portal. It's, it's definitely one of the craziest ones. Uh, I think one cost reroll is the best tier, right? Because again, you are level 5, but you can play 7 units. If you're level 7, you can play 7 units. If you're level 8, you can play 8 units, but... If you're level to 7, compared to a level 5 player, it's the same thing, right? Death is not always Here we go, that's big. 4 behemoth now. Let me just see who is exalted. Shen is exalted! Okay, that's good. Kha'Zix is exalted. Kha'Zix is exalted. Could reroll Kha'Zix as well, honestly speaking. Azir obviously would be nice. Timo. I could just reroll Timo as well. How bad can it be, right? How bad can it be to reroll Timo as well? We're already rerolling the Shen. I, I assume a lot of people are gonna reroll some other stuff. Yeah. Okay, we'll see how this goes, guys. It's gonna be a weird one. Our Shen carry augment is very cool. Um, it gives him plus three range, and he deals double the damage. And he deals a lot of true damage, as you can see, because he deals true damage based on his armor. So I think the best items you want to give him is like Ginsu's Bramble Vest and then Gunblade or something. You do not want to give him Shoujin. Shoujin is really bad. The reason why Shoujin is really bad is because he is mana locked. I think I'll just grab a Shen here. Uh, he is mana locked during his ult. He uses his ult and then for 4 seconds he deals, takes less damage. And uh, allies around him take less damage. And then for the next um, 3 auto attacks during those 4 seconds, he deals bonus true damage based on his armor. So... Um, yeah, he's, he's gonna be mana locked during that those 4 seconds, so Shoujin is not very good, you're gonna waste a lot of the mana on it. Shoujin is not recommendable. Mm. I mean, we're just playing full Behemoth, of course, because, because Behemoth gives him armor and magic resistance. We'll play Kha'Zix. Um, Behemoth. More Behemoths. There's a 3 cost, which one was it? The uh, Thresh, where is he? There he is. And then we just need an Orn or an Udir. Probably just gonna be an Orn, because I don't think I'll find a Legendary. Because I'm spending most of my time at level 6. And then we have to this thing. 
could just play Teemo as well. We can field 7 units. We can field 7 units. We could just play a Teemo. Teemo reroll as well. It's gonna be a weird freaking game. But I am gonna get Exalted. Which is pretty good. It's gonna give me bonus damage. It's not too bad. Okay, let's see. Uh, you do get 10 bonus gold from this uh, portal as well. You do get 10 bonus gold, which it doesn't say here anymore, but it did give me 10 bonus gold, so that's pretty good. I'm playing Bruiser for now. Could I play Exalted already? I don't know. Wait, I could play Exalted already. Don't I just do it then? You get one bonus XP every turn. And it's pretty good, right? And then I can play Yone reroll as well. Yone for the Kha'Zix. Yone dual carry, something like that, bro. This is gonna be a weird freaking game. <laughs> this is gonna be a weird freaking game, guys. Okay. Yone for the Kha'Zix. If we 3 star Kha'Zix as well. Which I don't think will happen. We're getting some XP, which is not bad. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. So we want probably Bramble. Let me actually consult the stats. Tactics.tools. Uh, stats. Explorer. Shen. 3 star. Filter number 2. Ethereal Blades. Uh. Ethereal blades. Why is there no count? Why is there no filter for that? There it is. Ethereal blades. Average 3.97. Items craftable. A delta. <sighs> Gunblade is good. Ginsu's is good. Uh, Titans is good for some reason. Bramble is good. Okay. Titans is good. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Bramble is 55 armor. And, um, oh wait, let me check again. 55 armor, okay. And then Titans is uh, 40 armor. 40 armor gives him also AP, gives him also attack damage. Titans looks better than Bramble, which is very surprising to me. A way better average placement, more sample size as well. And then Gunblade, yeah. Not gonna argue with the statistics, guys. I'm down to try this, yeah. We level to 6 right now, and we roll it down, right? We roll a little bit. And see what happens. Titans, huh? Interesting, no? Titans, interesting. Gives him some AP as well, so he gets takes less damage, right? His uh, damage reduction result scales with AP as well. So that's not bad. Also, I've seen people frontline him. Not turbo frontline, but like second line. So he can, because his AoE can hit his frontline champions then and take some, take some less damage. Wow, gets from the Fallen is good, right? Everyone dies except for him and he just 1v9s. Yeah. This gives me a Shen, though. But I feel like the Ghostly thing, I'll only play two Ghostly at most. I won't even play Ghostly, I'll keep it a buck. Nah, it's Gifts from the Fallen, bro. He's just gonna 1v9. Uh, I'm pretty sure we should roll here. For some two stars. Roll for some two stars. Potential. This looks like a pretty strong team right now. This looks like a pretty strong team. I'll keep it a stack. I don't think I mind this. Uh, yeah, this looks to have potential, right? And then look, I can go Bloodthirster, Hodge on Yone. This looks to have potential. I just three-star all of these idiots. I don't really need to 3-star Teemo, I can just keep him 2-star because I'm never really gonna be able to play Trickshot, right? I need to reach level 8 for Trickshot. That's impossible. Also, I just realized I need to reach level 9 for Exalted. Ugh. 
I would need to reach, need to reach level 9 for 6 Behemoth. I'm pretty sure I just need 6 Behemoth, right? That's the most important part of this, I think. I'm pretty sure I'm, like, super strong now. So I don't have to roll right now. I think 2-star Shen is extremely powerful. Yeah, 3.4k damage. Very good with this augment. We do want Gunblade. Gunblade is going to be great. It's going to heal him and his allies, right? And then um, we just want... I don't think we play with this guy. I think we just level to 8 and we play 6 Behemoth. We roll for Shen 3, we level to 8 and we play 6 Behemoth. And then we can add the Yone later, but I, at this point we don't even want to add him. We just play Kane, bro. We're just playing Kane, yeah. We go level 8 and we play Kane as our secondary de damage dealer, and then we do have Ghostly as well. Why would I prioritize Umbral over Ghostly? I mean, I, uh, the reason why is because I wanted to 3-star the Yone as well, which is kind of accessible, right? This guy already has a 3-star. Uh, this guy's winning the game, right? He already has 3-star Caitlyn with really good items. It's level 6, full health, yeah. This guy's winning the game for sure. It is what it is. I'm just gonna grab this cane. It has a rod for Gunblade. Don't see anything wrong with that. It gives me a cane right now. Ghostly is gonna be better than Umbral here. And the cane is a better unit than Yone. Whew, okay, weird. A Bloodthirster is also fine. Placement. Hodge is positive Delta, so that's not good. Okay. Okay, I think this is it. This is as much as I can do. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to play Exalted. I'm not gonna go Rod yet, because I might not get a sword. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to play Exalted. I think this is too greedy. But I need to find six uh, Behemoth first, right? As soon as I find six Behemoth, I'll play those. Instead of Exalted. Yep. Yes, sir. Nautilus is also Exalted and Azir. Azir would be a really good late game carry. I think we just play Exalted at level 9. When we reach, uh, when we when we do find a zero, right? When we can find a zero, then we can put an exalted back in. Remember, exalted scales with the level as well, so I'm only getting 10% bonus damage right now. Level nine, I will be getting 13% bonus damage, right? One per level. That's for a base. It's pretty good, especially later though. But it's good. It's it's a way to scale our Shen's damage, right? It's a way to scale our Shen's damage. I'm just gonna buy this guy. There's another exalted guy, but that guy's worse. Okay. I'm chilling. I'm stable. I'm gonna roll down to zero after this and hope I find six shens. This guy has two shens. Zero shens. Zero shens. Zero. 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 We start shen, right? Star Shen and he's holding another one. He's holding a fourth Shen. Yeah, unfortunate, bro. Not much I can do, right? Contested. Quiet contested, right? With these smaller back sizes, this is just a death sentence, basically. When you even. When, you, when people even ha hold like a two star Shen, it's already a death sentence. When two people are holding two star Shen, it's already. Uh, it's already over. It's already very difficult to find. For the two costs, it's almost the equivalent of before the back size change of someone having a three star. Okay, and now I have to play uh, six behemoth, right? I feel like we just play Teemo, man. I have to find a carry that will fit into this. Bro, a zero would be so nice, man. A zero would just be perfect. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we just roll down now. If we don't find Shen 3, it's over. Gotta find Shen 3 here. We got another rod. It's probably already Loki over. It just is what it is, man. I have more Threshes than Shens. And now we're even. I don't need Ionic Spark. I 
mean, it looks like I'll three-star this guy, right? I'm one off Shen 3. Not sure why I'm holding freaking Yorick, man. That doesn't really do anything. I'm one off Shen 3. Exalted is level 9, so we don't even have to think about this. 6 Behemoth. Shen is doing pretty well. Almost Shen 3, okay. Tiny but deadly. Harm assist. Harm assist is good. Like, it only helps Shen. I don't think it's final ascension. I think it's high key, tiny but deadly, bro. So much attack speed. That's pretty freaking good, no? With the Ginsu's, we stack it up faster. Or is Harmesis better? I feel like Harmesis, he just 1v9s at the end, right? Like, with Gunblade and Harmesis, you know? Just go both. In darkness, we find ourselves. I herald the greatest blessing. Ready for this? Congratulations, we're dead. One off both. Perfect. <laughs> Not much we can do, can we? Armacist. Armacist and gifts from the fallen. That is a nasty augment combination, guys. They all die. He gets the freaking bonus stats from them dying. And he just cleans up the fight, you know? That is one very nasty combination. Wait, we can be level 8 for Exalted. I'll just go level 8 for Exalted, I guess. But I would like to find an Azir. I mean, I find an Azir, I'm chilling. Yeah, I'm chilling. I for sure have to roll here. 50% health. <sighs> I don't think I ever sell Thresh. Uh, yeah, exalted. Like, we're almost exalted, right? Like, just level 8. The thing is, level 7 will not give me another unit, right? Remember, guys, level 7 is not giving me an additional unit to be played. I need a Gunblade. It's gonna be really good, for sure. It's gonna heal my frontline as well. It's gonna heal my sh my Thresh. That's gonna be great. This guy's a 3-star Aatrox. Interesting. Not bad at all, though. We do have true damage. His Dvarpala stone play gives him a lot of resistances, but we have true damage. Don't think it freaking matters, it also gives him healing. It does not matter, guys. This game is not very good, huh? I didn't hit. I am third pick as well. So I don't think we'll get this. So we will not have our item. Which is extremely bad. Unless no one wants it. That's really lucky. That is perfect, guys. Nice. So we did get our item. Now we just need one beautiful Shen, one beautiful Thresh. And honestly, I think I'm in a really decent position afterwards. Because I got this Thresh tree as well, man. It's going to be very tanky. Super tanky unit. As you wish. I want to see everything. Okay. We did it. That is not bad. Now remember, we will not level because it doesn't do anything. <laughs> we will just chill until we have 50 gold. Until we can double level <laughs> to level 8, right? Leveling doesn't do anything. Okay. Huh. If I do reach level 9 somehow, I'll be very strong. I can even play Trick Shot. I play Kai'Sa as my carry. <laughs> That's another carry. That's pretty good. If I do reach level 9, but level 9 is like so out of reach now, right? Yeah, impossible. We would need an encounter that brings us to level 9. Like an encounter that gives us money. We win this pretty easily, right? 10k damage, Shen. Okay, we're cooking. The Titans is the same damage as Bramble, as whenever I have Bramble, so this is good. Because the Titans gives him also some attack damage and stuff, right? Uh, Aatrox offers you a component, anvil, player health, or gold. 
I think I'll take the 10 gold. It's gonna generate me interest rate faster. I think I'll take the 10 gold, I'll risk it. Should probably take player health. But I'll risk it for the biscuit. For the biscuit, guys. <laughs> like a bad bussy. So obviously this guy's still dominating. Level 8 now. With all of his units. Yeah, not bad. Oh, hey, come on, Shen. You can do it, bro. I believe in you. I took harm assist for you. And I took gifts from the fallen. Come on, man. You can pop this Nar. You deal true damage. You're gonna freaking 3-tap that little boy. Come on, man. Bam. Bam. Not quite a 3-tap. But the next ult is gonna kill him. Yeah, next ult is gonna kill him, which is good. Let's go, Shen. Boom. Boom. Nice. Let's go, Shen. Good job. Very freaking good. Impressive. I like the Titans built. Again, I always... My, my intuition was Ginsu's Gunblade Bramble. I am very glad that the intuition was uh, pretty much almost the perfect build. That means I'm smart, guys. Are you impressed a little bit? We can be, we can be proud of that. We can be proud of that a little bit, guys. Come on. Because this build is not in, like the intuition, uh, you know? Yeah. Good job. Thank you. Good job, Amumu. Bro, I'm not a Mumu, man. I cut my hair. Also, it's not emo a Mumu anymore, man. It's a freaking... It's a freaking teacup a Mumu, man. It's not emo a Mumu. That's last set news. Find a new champion, man. Find a new freaking champion. You freaking losers. Nice, we made 40. That's big. Cannot level yet. Sword. What's Sword gonna do? Shojin? Eventually. Ah. Yo. Uh, I'm guessing uh, Giant Slayer. Then. I'm guessing Giant Slayer. And then eventually you find a new team or something. Um. So what's Exalted? Okay, I need to find an exalted unit, right? When I level. I cannot make it to level 8 yet. I think he 1v9s, watch this. Like a boss, guys, like a boss he does. Why is he stunned for like 15 minutes? He just one-shots them, man, and life steals back to 50%. Like a freaking boss he stuns, man. Yeah, like a freaking boss. Freak you, man. Like a boss he is, man. Okay, the plot thickens. The plot is thickening, sickening. Do you think he can ult once? Maybe. Maybe he can ult once. Like a freaking Babusi. Maybe he can ult once. Ah, uh, maybe. Um, so level 9, we just want the boy. Level 9, we play Azir, and we kick Teemo, and then we can play Lilia. We, we will get Dryad, Mythic, and we will get uh, Invoker. That's pretty good. I'll take it, bro. I think that's my max cap. I can reach level 9 somehow. I don't think we win this, man. Bro, 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 bro. If you ult again, I can win. So close, bro. I need to roll for 3-star Thresh. I'm dead. I don't think there's any level 9 chance for us. I think we just need to donkey roll for 3-star Thresh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. And it's just well deserved because I made the right decision, right? Like, did I, did I make the right decision or did I make the right decision? I made the right decision. Did I make the right decision or did I make the right decision? I made the right decision. Did I make the right decision or did I make the right decision? I made the right decision. We can play Heavenly. Might as well play Heavenly, right? For now. Because we don't have a Zir. We're, we don't have a Zir, we're not level 9. This Shen is legit. I mean, it's a carry augment, right? He's supposed to be legit. 
He's a little bit underpowered, maybe, but honestly, nah, he's, he's just good. He's just decent. Ah, maybe he's a little bit underpowered. Because I feel like carry augment plus 3 star and you only have a 3.9 average, it's not that good, right? Because you're not always gonna 3 star him when we take the carry augment. This guy's level 9, bro. Lucky gloves and the freaking other lucky gloves augment. That's just. That's just a little bit silly, right? Did we kill the. Wait. My frontline is too strong. It's good that I'm fighting him here. He doesn't have a Zier 2 yet. If he had a Zier 2, he would beat me. A Zier 2, I really are 2, he beats me. So it's really lucky that we fight him here. Let's go. Nice, man. If I can get top 4, I'm super happy. Dryad Invoker. No Azir. Trojan. Sunfire. I mean, I I'm taking the Sunfire, bro. Another Thresh, by the way. Freak you, man. Don't need that anymore. I'm taking the Sunfire, bro. I don't have heal reduction. And heal reduction is really important because I, I can't burst them down. I do three attacks, they drop low, and they can heal back up until I can do three attacks again. That deal bonus damage. <laughs> Let the Kha'Zix die instantly for the for the bonus. Remember, the heavenly bonus is giving us some more armor and magic resistance from the mount fight, which uh, helps him a little bit, right? Helps him a little bit. Raises damage a little bit. We'll take it. Three star Caitlyn. I mean, honestly, these comps I can beat, bro. Like, all of these comps I just looked at, I think I can beat them. What is this guy, level 9? I think I can beat him. If I kill the Kane soon, after this Nico, I beat him easily. He doesn't have tight, uh, he doesn't have Edge of Night on okay. Kane. Kane is getting focused. He's gonna die after the next ult. This whole team is gonna gang up on me, huh? Nice. Honestly, this is a win. I don't think uh, Wukong can kill me. Nice, good job. Alright, is this guy dead? No, right? Stage 5 is not enough. It's like 9. Yeah, 9 base damage or something. Oh, another encounter. Gold. 80 gold. Frick it. 100 gold. Treasure Armory. Please don't be prismatic, man. Oh, nice, there's a guy. Uh, this is pretty good. This is really good, right? We can't, we can't greet this. Nasher's double, double GS. Ah, uh, I'll greet it. Ah, uh, that's better. Nice, deserve. We are made by our Freaking deserve, man. Holy deserve. Nah, I'm, I'm a boss, guys. I really am, though. Nah, I, I am a boss. I am a freaking boss, guys. Oh no, I should be playing this. I don't have Mythic yet. I don't have Mythic yet, bro. Okay, I don't think I lose against Ghost. I don't think I lose against Ghost. I think I should still play uh, Exalted. Eh, I'm playing Exalted. I should still play uh, Heavenly. Like, 10 armor magic resistance can make a bit, big diff. High key. Caitlyn cannot one-shot me, so I just win, right? What the frick is this unit, man? What? Nah. Nah. One, nah. Nah, nah, uh-uh. No one died? Nah. I lost against Ghost. There's something funky, man. I mean, I don't think it's a heavenly diff, bro. <laughs> I mean, honestly, I, I wouldn't be surprised. That that made no sense, bro. That made no sense. That is just straight up a imbalanced unit, no? This should get Giga nerfed. <laughs> no cap. Like, what the frick is this, man? I probably had a lot of ghostly. Ah, I had a lot of ghostly counters. Okay, sure, sure. I probably had infinite ghostly counters, right? Yeah, okay. I didn't see he's playing six ghostly, because usually you play Caitlyn reroll with a different comp. So I just assumed it's that comp without even paying attention. He's playing full ghostly. That that makes more sense. Sure, sure bro. That makes more sense. Ah, Thieves Glove here. You know what's freaking annoying? I just gave him an item. So then I just want to stack him. What's our next combat? Magic damage. Also magic damage. So we just go Dragon Claw. On our Ornington. Okay, I mean, what the frick is this? Please, let me win this game, man. I mean, I'm not winning against Irelia 2, am I? Is this a fifth? 
Okay, it's the it's the seven fated guy. He's really strong too though. One star set, one star play, one star Udir seems winnable. Hopefully it's winnable. Getting stunned. He killed set, which is good. Azir is cooking as well a little bit. Syndra is really strong, is ramping up her freaking thing. Gonna get focused soon though, by my Shen. Oh my god, Shen is a genius, he just went to the right. Like a freaking babusi. Bro, no one died. No one's dying. Come on, guys. Finish them. The frick are you doing? T6 to level. T6 to level. I mean, don't, don't I have to sell this in level? I can play at 3 costs, right? Or am I stupid? No. I have 57 if I sell him. I can play at 1 cost. Oh, God, yeah, I can't, even, can't even do it, guys. <laughs> I can't even play anything. But leveling gives me more exalted damage. Can it make the difference between winning and losing? Low key, it can, right? Okay, this guy, we won against him last time, but it was close. And he had a one star Wukong without full items. Now he has a two star Wukong. But I I had, I didn't have a Zir. Look, a Zir is killing the, front, uh, the, the small units. That way, the Shen doesn't have to waste attacks on the small units. He's focusing Wukong. Oh, he has Edge of Night now, but Edge of Night pop. Oh, he's gonna kill Wukong and Kane super fast. Bro, that was so tilting. He almost died. <laughs> because he just gets stunned for 15 minutes. Piece of garbage, bro. Okay. Wait, am I even supposed to not play Kogma? Maybe I'm just supposed to play Invoker and that's it. Like, I feel like I'm supposed to play Ko uh, supposed to play Kha'Zix. The armor magic resistance is better than Mythic. Like, who even gets Mythic, bro? This guy? And freaking Lilia that I don't even have? Okay, I, surely I'm- I, surely the, the, the Caitlyn matchup was a fluke, right? It was a bug. The Caitlyn matchup was a bug. I'm not losing to freaking Caitlyn again. That was a freaking bug if I've ever seen one, right? That that was a bug. It was a bug. For real. It was a giga bug. Giga bug. Yes! I got lucky. She stepped forward. Oh my god, he almost died to the ghostly. I mean the ghostly thing is insane, right? Look look at the magic damage. This is all the ghostly trait doing. Doing it, yeah. Oh, please give me that. Please give me that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop. Stop, you fool. Do we play Ghostly? I feel like Ghostly 2 does nothing. I, I would say Invoker does more. More more utility. Yeah, yeah, Invoker does more. It gives more utility. Invoker is way more utility. Oh my god. I mean, we get crit chance. It doesn't really do anything. Invoker is way more utility, and the two-star any is good. Oh, there, there was an Udir, by the way. Am I stupid? I mean, honestly, didn't I prevent him? Like, does it even matter if I have an Udir, though? Like, he's just gonna die anyway. But this way, I have an any too. I just predicted that I would just high roll any too. And now I have a freaking tank, like a boss. Yes, I do. Yes, I do, guys! Yes, I do! Yes, I'm a genius! Okay, so this guy I'm very afraid of. He didn't have Huey 2 last time, he didn't have Udir 2, but Udir has no items. The, the, the Nautilus stunt the wrong way! The Nautilus stunt the wrong way! My Azir is still alive! We win those! I think we win those. Yeah? Udir is dead? Come on, please, please, it's a top 2 if I win this. It's a freaking top 2 if I win this, nice, it looks good. That's crazy, guys, it's a freaking top 2 out of nowhere, no? That was a crazy game, man. That was satisfying. We lose against this guy, of course. We lose against this guy, of course. Look, we got so lucky avoiding him. Two-star Huey, two-star this, two-star this. All the legendaries, two-star, two-star Rakan. This is impossible to win, right? With lucky gloves, sl sleight of hand, patience, like it's, it's impossible to win. Any is better. Any is better than the girl. I could buy this if I somehow win a five, but the, let's last fight anyway. Alright, frigate. 
We can try, I guess. I don't think we beat him. I think uh, they do too much damage. He has three two-star legendary carries with very good items, all of them. So, Lucky gloves on his other legendaries. My Azir dies here. That's okay, though. Like, if I put him to the left, he's gonna get slammed by freaking Udyr and stuff. Like, they have so much... There's so much backline access, right? The, the, the Aurelia is poking down. I don't think we win those. What? 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 <laughs> the Azir summoned the Sand Soldier right here and body blocked the freaking way. That's hilarious. <laughs> what the frick? In the body blocked freaking way. That was hilarious, bro. But, you know, we can't win. We can't win. Because the next fight, he's just gonna win, man. Like, if he, if he just fixes that positioning, he's gonna win the next fight. <clears throat> so it doesn't even matter, bro. But that's funny, no? That is funny, guys. That is hilarious, bro. The only way I win is if I get, like, 50 gold here and I hit 2-star Udyr, 2-star Azir. Right. Then I can win. I'm pretty sure two star, like even one star Udyr is better, right? One star Udyr is better, right? For sure, than the, than the freaking Chugath trash. I mean, Dragon Claw is very good here. I'm pretty sure I put it on Udyr, actually. I think he's the strongest one out of the bunch. I'll put him in the corner. Let's see if that saves him a little bit more. But both, like everything, is dangerous because of the I really on stuff, right? But it should be a little bit better, honestly. Like, look at this freaking Udyr, man. Just freaking obliterates my Shen, but my Shen has so much healing. The thing is, it's stunning him, right? But it's feeding him mana. Wait a second. He's feeding him mana. I'll take it. This is the goofiest fight I've ever seen. What the frick is this, bro? But eventually, the Irelia just goes crazy and kills everything, right? Oh, I think I won! <laughs> what? Bro, is Shen broken as frick? Is Shen the best thing in the game? What the frick was this goofy fight? They're just sitting there, man. There were like three fights at the same time. Azir... Azir jerking off the enemy's Azir's Sand Soldier, the enemy Azir jerking off my Azir's Sand Soldier, then a freaking Shen Udyr 1v1. Holy frick, man! Are we playing TFT or wa are we watching a Yaoi anime? Well, no, no, I don't know what that means. No, Ya, 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 Yui, Ya, Yu, Ya, Ya, Yi? Nah, I don't know. No, 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 no. Someone, someone said that a couple days ago, so I just repeated it. I don't actually know what it... No, I don't know what that is. No, I don't know. No, see... see. <laughs> Subscribe, ring Haitian bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time. Peace.